heart and soul. In music and poetry, my heart and soul reside. Words remain forever, while poetry still lies inside. Melodies are haunted and can pierce you even through bone. Soft notes are so relaxing, like the winds whisper as they blow. I find in them myself, I find in them the world, and then the emotion of 10,000 hearts, then in my heart be held. In music and poetry, I find them, I find my heart and soul. Uh, this one is a Halloween poem, so it's a little odd, but it's kind of spooky. It's called Spooky, actually. In the night I strike, in the night I thrive. By the moon I live, by the moon I cry. I loom in the darkness like a tigress ready to pounce. And in the darkness do I pray on the moon's light, and in that light I stay. Be careful as you go forth and walk along the path. For I am there watching you. Listen, and you'll hear me laugh. <laughs> Time. In weight of nothing, hard to find, something that does not exist, it has no rhyme. Like the rest of the world, whose rhyme carries on, this thing I'm searching for is much too far gone. Hard to explain, See it, I cannot, this hope that keeps me wandering until an abrupt cold stop. The tracks have ended on this meandering train, and everything I had been waiting for all dashed again. I am in wait of nothing, it is hard to find, and like a fool I saw something, never can I hold it, never can it be mine. thousand lives. Not every picture is monochrome. Not every picture must be in neon lights. A picture can be faded and yet hold a thousand words, as long as the lines are right. Everyone lives their lives differently. We aren't meant to be the same. Some are bold, bedazzled, jewel-toned lights. Others fade into the background while their hearts glow dim and ember warmth spreading to another's life. The world is full of variation, flowers, landscapes, food. The world was never meant to be the same, and really, I am different too. <laughs> whiskey in a teacup. She is whiskey in a teacup. She is fire in my veins. She is a porcelain doll, strong and unbreakable falling to pieces every other day. She is whiskey in a teacup. She is lightning when the sun shines bright. She defies tranquility and stirs up pain. She is like a dozen roses, all of them sent in vain. She is whiskey in a teacup, beautiful as can be. But if she finds I love her, that will be the end of me. Eyes of the storm. She took a sip of water to calm her burning nerves. She tried to let the storm pass her, but it covered her in waves. She let out all her breath, trying to breathe against the wind. But when she exhaled it out, the vortex tried to suck her in. She stood her ground and looked on upward. She yelled then at the sky. She cried, why are you so angry? It replied, no, it is you, not I. Sunny nights. There is daylight in the sorrow. There is a candle in the mist. There are bright suns painted against midnight skies, and there are answers in all the whys. The silent sound of nighttime is punctuated by a beating heart, and when the sun goes down, does nocturnal life even start. There is beauty in the sadness and the brokenness of hearts, yet light will come amidst all those tears, and healing will come out of all those years of hurting. Trust. 
I am brave and I am bold. I am sensitive yet free. I will push on forthward through life with only the weight of the air shackling me. I am fearless, I have passion, and I know I will go far because all things will work out for my good. All that's left will be a scar. Cold Spring. In the dark, majestic mountains loom, painful and serene, peaceful and serene, sorry. Mysterious under the moon, water mirroring them, so cold, moving as if alive. I stand here on the dock and take in the star-filled sky. This around me is my paradise, so often, and today I watch with the water. I watch it breathe. I watch it move. As the mountains stand still, freezed. Today, this is my paradise. Today, I stand here strong. Today, I'm surrounded by beauty. And here in this nature is where I belong. The door. Meant to soar, meant to fly, meant to live and not sit by. But that is what I'm doing, paralyzed by fear. Tears from my eyes will not come, but inwardly flood waters rise. Confused and shaken, I stumble. My footing is not always sure. I've been a good poet, dutiful to my work, but will I sink or will I swim? If I take one path over another, can that be called a sin? Have I reached my full potential, reality waiting as I long for more? Or is that the answer, the very thing itself? Maybe if I just unlock the door. <laughs> Dormant Volcano. She leaves thunder in her wake where dormant volcanoes once quaked. She is silent as the night Cool as November seas, she is calm and balanced within, yet still stirring with emotions that she will not let win. No, she is the dormant volcano, waiting to erupt, but holding back. She does not want her wrath to burn and melt whom she loves, or destiny and tear her down and tear down her accomplishments as her fire rages from above. No, I am a peaceful force and my timing will be superb. One day, I'll get this right. One day, you have my word. <laughs> Apollo. Strong structure, the build of Apollo, Greek god, arms formed in muscle and strong bone, holding the weight of his world upon his shoulders. Hair like strings of gold, cascading down his firm back. Working hands that have seen too much heartache. Adam, man, stands tall, like a pillar in the temple of Zeus. He looks out on the life before him with little hope for a bright future. His heart beats strong like a perfect drum, defiantly, against all odds, still to continue. Adam, don't you know you are the subject of art? The reason the wind blows, Take heart, man, and see where the wind goes. <laughs> <laughs>